sister. She's the best person I know, and she's saved my life uh, in more ways than one. Yeah. How did she help you? Um, 2018 was like a rough year for me. I had left a career that I thought I was going to be in forever. Mm -hmm. um, the Army didn't end up working out for me uh, for a number of reasons, but I, I, uh, I ended up breaking my back uh, pretty, pretty bad. And uh, like I'm 26 years old and I can barely walk up the steps. And like, I um, was living in a city that was too expensive for me and I was like, completely lost. My life was, was very dark. Um, and like, I didn't know how to say that I needed things. Um, I don't know if you can relate with like that or like how, how that can be. Um, mm -hmm. The only person I confided in was my sister, and um, um, some like I'm trying to like give you the whole picture, but it's okay, uh, you have time. Um, you know, I uh, I guess we can go deep. Um, I. Uh, I had two failed suicide attempts in uh, 2018 and 2019. Um, no, I and I don't mean to like throw that on you. It's like a weird thing to do here. Um, my sister, she doesn't know, and I guess she'll know now. <laughs> I know. And when I get worried and I get nervous, I smile. And so I'm like smiling. You're fine. Um, but I didn't want to be here anymore. And for the same reason that I don't like to share, because I didn't want to burden anybody with my problems. And uh, I thought that the easiest way was to just not be around. Luckily, it didn't work. And the only thing that got me through that was her, and she has no idea. She saved my life, and so I, I, I owe her everything. I uh, told her. No, that would make her more worried. I just didn't think it was the right time or the right place. And so I, I uh, through being very intentional and aggressive with my therapy, the person that you see before you today, like, isn't that person. It's insane that I just told you that because I, like, don't tell people that. Ben. I was very scared about sharing all of those things. Really? Yeah, and I, uh, I'm okay. You're okay. And that's pretty cool. And I'm still right here. Yeah. I see you, and I hear you, and that's all I've been wanting. I just, I, I've been wanting you to open up to me, and I've been wanting to, like, get to know you. You're an amazing person. I don't want to cry, but uh, thank you. I really appreciate it, for you just being here. Absolutely. It literally means the world to me.